When you're trying to diagnose state of health issues on a hybrid high voltage battery, typically we use a scan tool. You know, go in there with the year model and request to talk to the battery's ECU, ask for data stream, then we can see stuff like the min-max battery voltage and all the block voltages. In this case, on a second generation Prius, there's 14 blocks to look at. Then we want to look at state of charge and the, uh, the delta temperature across the battery pack and try to make sense of all this stuff so we can figure out state of health. Works real well, but it's time consuming. Well, now we have a tool that we can use to plug into the diagnostic connector and drive the vehicle around for a short period of time. And this tool will figure out the state of health for us. And this is really going to cut down on our diagnostic time. Let's get started. The first step is to plug this wireless convergence module into the OBD2 connector. And we can adjust it to make sure that it doesn't interfere with vehicle operation. In some cases, that may not be possible. So there's a short cable that's available to move the convergence module off to the side. The next step is to turn on the analyzer so that it can communicate with the convergence module and then we'll program in the vehicle's information. With this tester, we can review trouble codes if we want to. We can do a run chart and that's where we're watching the battery voltage go in and out of the battery as we drive the vehicle around. Or we can do a drive test to determine the battery state of health. Let's take it for a ride. One of the things that speeds up this test is to be sure that the high voltage battery pack is up to temperature. You know, drive the vehicle around a little bit before we actually do the test, and then the test will conclude that much sooner. By performing some acceleration maneuvers like I'm doing now, and then some braking maneuvers like I'm doing now, that'll speed up the conductance part of the test. Now that we've heard the beep and we know the test has been completed, we'll take it back to the shop and we'll get a printout and a really good indication of the state of health of this high voltage battery pack. Well, now that we're back at the shop, we can print out the results of our drive test. And the printer that comes with the tester is wireless. So all we have to do is aim the tester at the printer and we start getting the printout. This is gonna be easy to analyze because the printout is gonna give us the average block voltage and the temperature spread across all the modules. And there'll even be an indication on the printer printout that says whether the battery's good or it's out of balance or it needs some sort of service. As we can see right here, we have a good battery pack and we can look at the average block voltage, the conductance, the temperature spread, and there's even an analog bar on here to give us a quick diagnostics of the battery state of health. 